We often see expanding fire-rated foam used in the incorrect application, and there seems some misunderstanding as to when you would use it and when you wouldn't use it. Fire-rated foam is traditionally in pink, but some manufacturers make it in blue and other colors. Expanding fire foam is a product that expands on application to fill a void and sets off and cures and stays in that state as a fire rated product and will not expand in the event of a fire. It will stay in its existing form for the set period that it's been fire rated to and then it will start to break down. Where we see expanding fire foam used um, successfully is often in a concrete to concrete application with no services, pipes or cables going through that application and there is a maximum size of the aperture that this has been tested in. Other areas we see it successfully used, as with this blue 60 fire foam, is around the door frame, between the door frame and the wall structure of a fire door set to create a fire seal. Where this is not used correctly is where it is used around pipes and cables and services between a fire compartment wall. As stated previously, this will um, not expand in the event of a fire and close any gaps left from the melted pipes or cables. This, when applied, will set off, but in the event of a fire, will expand and close off gaps around pipes and cables and surfaces. This can be used on both clusters of cables, plastic pipes and metal surface pe penetrations. It is suitable for both plastic and metal cables, how we would always recommend referring to the manufacturer's documentation and guidelines around installation as to what it is and isn't suitable for and the penetrations that are able to be used with intumescent sealant. Some intumescent sealants are a graphite based product and a high pressure exerting sealant or a HPE sealant uh, which have a greater field of application and can be used around different both clusters of cables and individual cables and pipes. We would always recommend uh, checking the manufacturer's uh, test specifications and installation guides as to what the uh, recommendations are 